These are so cute. Cause they Greetings, fellow human being. I cracked. You heard that? Greetings, fellow human beings. <laughs> What's up, y'all? I'm gonna be trying on a whole bunch of clothes. Fashion over haul, quarantine haul. I'm doing this little social distancing thing, so he can't be here today, which is why we have him on the laptop. His name is Kwame. Let's get straight to it. So I got this big bag for Fashion Nova because I ordered $600 worth of clothes and it's real heavy. All right, let's see what we have here. I guess the first thing I'm gonna try on is the first thing I picked up, which is this Fuzzy Friends hoodie set and it's lavender. It's what it looks like. It's a nice little around the house outfit. I really like it because it's different. I've never had nothing like this before. The sleeves are like loose and I got it in a size large because got a little cut up right here. He's here because he's going to be rating these outfits. So let's see what he thinks. What would you rate this out of a 1 out of 10? Uh, I give it an 8. Why 8? I feel like it just take that, that one nail in the wall. Or like you just take that one thing to be caught on and it's just all coming apart. Uh so he thinks since it's made out of like knit material that it'll snag easily. But this is so pretty. It is see-through, obviously, because it's knit. So keep that in mind. Oh, and the hoodie it has a hoodie on it. Hoodie on those uh stay focused. On to the next. This one is called More To Give Pants Set. It's the color Rust. And I also got this in a size large. It's real cute. It's tight fitting, which I like, which is why I got it. It has this little bow right here so you can like adjust this, like how high you want it. But I'm gonna keep it where they got it because that's cute. I think it complements like my hair color. And I am five, six, and this goes all the way down to my ankles. So I consider myself on the taller side. So if you're tall, go ahead and get this. All these sets are in a size large, by the way. <laughs> this is the ribbed material. And I love shirts like this, which is why I'm so happy that I found pants like this as well. What would you rate this? I'm rate this by eight because it complements your hair color. I already seen the cons, so I'm say eight and a half because the last one had a con and this one doesn't. I guess it make you look snatched because I gained like 10 pounds and I don't see those 10 pounds real anymore. On to the next outfit. This one is called Totally Ribbed Skirt Set. So it's supposed to be the same kind of material as this, but except for this is black. It's off the shoulder. It got these little, it's like when you cut a shirt and it curl up. That's what this is like. Um, I already knew I wasn't that much of a fan of stuff that like connects right here, but I have to try it out. This one is kind of like I have a small chest and so this is like, it has space for someone who doesn't have a small chest. It like snatches so it's not going to like fall down or anything. I just kind of have to keep pulling it up a little bit. If you can't tell by now, I'm a monochrome style person. Like I like clothes that's like all the same color. The skirt is not gonna like go up or anything. It's pretty secure. It's just it's something different. I'm trying to like redo my wardrobe so what do you think? Oh well, it's black. That's my favorite color. I like the style of shirt because it looks like it's not supposed to function as a shirt but somehow I do. I don't really like the skirt because it looks like if you had it wrong you couldn't. So just off the strength of it being black, kind of like the top, I'm gonna give it a, a eight and a half. If the shirt was like pants, I'll probably give it like a nine. Next outfit, it is called As If Vibes Pants Set. From right here, yes, it look cute, but it took like 
three minutes just to get the pants on. It's really tight right from here to like here. The waist is like really big for some reason. And then this keeps like folding up, like the tag keeps showing. Something that keeps it in. Like I'd rather had it been like that. And then the top obviously fits. I don't really like how the lines go inward. I would rather them go straight down. I thought it was gonna come down to here. That would have been cute. This would have looked like from the back. I mean, don't get me wrong. I'm gonna still wear this. Everything can't be perfect, right? At least I got them on. This actually might be the look. What do you think? Black and white, so extra points. I like the way it's show off your jewelry. I like the uh, the pattern too. It's classic. You put a span on old timey patterns. Yeah. On to the next. I really, really, really like this. Another one of these kind of shirts. And I think like me doing a YouTube video on this would be really cute. It says baby girl. The actual name of this shirt is called Better Than She Does Off Shoulder Top. I got this in a size large and the arms when I was um, putting it on seemed really tight. But on you don't even feel suffocated or anything. I feel like this part is extra large and this part is like small honestly but whatever this is what it looks like from the back um what would you rate this shirt just the shirt like the style shirt is cool the color is cool but i feel like the text is generic without the text i give it a, a nine. i like the text because it's cool to me and then the next thing i got are these pants they are called on the level high rise distressed jeans dark denim these are so cute because they got the little holes and then they're dark. I love dark pants. My skin poke out right here. It fits really perfect. It's not tight or nothing. I got these in a size 15. Now, don't do too much. I usually wear a size 10 in pants, but like in jeans, but I stopped wearing pants for like years and years and years. And then I just threw away some. So I was like, well, I guess I gotta get some new ones. And the size chart, um, they said like, I, I thought because my hips was a um, 43 that I would need a size 15 or 17, but I didn't think back to like my regular pants size because I forgot about that. But yeah, um, my waist is like 31. So these fit a 32 waist, they're stretchy, but they like good thing that they're stretchy and they stretch it back to me. Because if these was like that and didn't come back in, I don't know what I would do. But they're really high-waisted. This is supposed to be a crop top. But since the pants are really high-waisted, you can't really tell. Um, I'm wearing this um, shirt with these pants because this was the only sh like single shirt that I got. And I admit, next time, I will get a size 13 in pants. Size down. But I I'm not mad. I thought these were going to be really baggy. And I did watch like a lot of reviews after I ordered these and they said, read the reviews before you get pants. So if I would have known that these are extra stretchy before I got them, I would have probably sized down. But I don't know. When I read the size chart, I rushed through it. It didn't really pay attention. But I just didn't want it to not fit my hips. But other than that, I like the distress on these. And they go all the way down to my ankles. What do you rate the jeans? Ten. I thought it was the first 10 I got this far. Or a 10. Yeah. You can't go wrong with jeans. I'm a big fan of jeans and they're dark. So it's like you can wear them with almost any color, mm -hmm. I feel like. And then they got the rips in them. So it's not like no old lady jeans, you know? <laughs> it was like a good jean. Honestly. Uh, I, feel, I feel like if you can look thick and denim then this is there for real because denim is not like a it's not a soft material so 10 out of 10 would recommend to a friend hey oh i didn't get these from fashion nova but my sister gave them to me and they're really cute yeah yes i would wear these glasses with this and i would probably I would wear my hair like this. So I did get one other pair of jeans because I do like distressed jeans. The only thing is that these kind of look exactly like these ones. 
these ones are called Nanette High Rise Jeans Medium Blue Wash. So they're a little bit lighter and they have, I think, more um, distress going on. Not too shabby. They do really, really look like the other ones, but they go down further with the distress. I am proud that I got a 15, 16 because these boys, like they get tighter as you go down and looser. Well, not really looser as you go up. I guess kind of looser. They got like, they're light right here. And again, they do come all the way down to my ankle. Oh, and one thing, this top keeps sliding down. It's a pretty top, like why? It's not, nothing like cinches it in right here like the other shirt did. I wish it had some type of band to make it stay. But this is cute, not even gonna lie. The next thing is a dress called Fancy Feel Cold Shoulder Mini Dress. I'm not even sure if I read that right, but I don't care. And it's heather gray and it's in a size large. I really, 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 really like dresses that go off the shoulder. And I never had a dress that goes off the shoulder and still has a strap. So that's pretty cool. It has like pearls, which is um, really classy. And you can move around in this. Oh. Don't lift up your arms because that's not cute. <laughs> <laughs> These things are bigger than need be because you don't even need them. They're just there. Hold on. Yeah, so honestly, if you didn't want the straps, just tuck them in. Simple. Um, the only thing I would say that they could do is like, again, put some elastic right here because it's just like flowy. But other than that, this is real cute. What would you rate this? 10. Just because it's so classy. Like you could wear that to somewhere official. Yes. So the next thing, it's called Loosen Up My Buttons Skirt Set, and it is yellow. So I'm really proud of this. I knew when I first touched this and put it on, the material is so good. It's kind of ribbed. It's nice and secure, so you can not wear a bra with this, which is real cool. I always um, vouch for that. And the skirt is real nice and firm. Like, it's not going to slide up. And I like how it goes all the way down. It's it's a nice monochrome set, which I like. And I feel like this yellow looks really nice on me. It kind of snatches you up. Not right here. I don't know what, what's going on right here. But it, um, you could be snatching this if you want. Love how it's square right here instead of just your conventional um, that. So the square cut is really classy. And it's just a real secure outfit. It's really very, 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 very secure. What? His connection keeps going out. Yeah, so his connection went out, but that's the problem with um, social distancing and quarantining. If your internet goes out, it's a wrap. What would you rate this? I'd give it a dollar nine. Why nine? Because it's modest. I like it for one, the color and like the style of the shirt. It, it's not revealing too much, but it doesn't have to. Mm -hmm. you know? Yeah. Yeah. Um, never had to do too much. Period. Boom. Never had and never will. Recognize. Huh. Uh, the next thing I'm going to try on is called. Hello Monday satin skirt set, also in a large. Let me just tie it up right here. So it fits. When I put on the skirt, it was real hard to get on. I thought it was not going to zip. But that's because you have to pull it up, like up to here, and then it zipped up. It snatches you in because it's tight. Um, I like the shirt. You can't go wrong with tying this up. It's meant to be tied. I feel like it looks real girly, real classy. Even though it is so in stomach, I still feel like 
Um, like who has this? Yeah. I used to be like, how can girls wear skirts that's that short without worrying if it's gonna come up? Um, it's so tight. It's not like how could it come up? You know. So what would you rate this? I give it a, 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 a eight. Why eight? I like the color. I like the material, but like again, the skirt looks really constricting, and the shirt is a bit out there for me. What you mean? Like it's a bit, it's a bit too odd for my taste. So it's like different. Yeah. Yeah. If I was to wear it in buttoned up, it would be like because I wore this already and I'm trying to go for a different look. But I feel like buttoned up, it kind of takes away the point of the shirt. Because otherwise, why is it tied up right here? I look so bomb right now. I feel like I look real expensive. Thus, that makes sense. Hey, what color is this? Mauve? It's pink. So the next thing I got is a jumpsuit. And it's called laid back nights jumpsuit um i have mixed feelings about this yes it's real 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 comfy i guess i would just wear this in the house honestly i don't i don't see myself going to wear this kind of wish i didn't get it like i could have got something else you know but it looked really cute on the model because it looked like she wore it like this and then it was like baggy right here i mean i guess I guess that's how you're supposed to wear it, honestly. Okay, never mind. I take it back. I take back what I said about not wanting to wear it anymore. I just, I guess I wasn't wearing it right. But when I pull it up, it doesn't go all the way down. If I wear it all the way down, it looks like this. I'm gonna wear it how she wore it. What would you rate this? I'm not giving it a rating because they're pajamas. This is called make you laugh pants set and it's blue it's not just blue though it, it to me it's like cloudy like rainy weather blue which is real cute it's not something that you would normally see the material was like like slippery i did not expect that i thought it was gonna be like thin cloth it's adjustable right here so you could make it however you want it to fit it goes all the way down I mean, not all the way down, but like a centimeter or an inch off. Let's see it with the glasses. I actually like this material so much better than what I thought it was going to be. Because it's like, it's nice and secure. It adds to it. Um, it's kind of weird back here again. I wish this was more like sewn in better. What would you rate this? Well... I feel like I've seen it, like I'm getting deja vu. I feel like I've seen it before, it's just a different color. But the color is really unique. I would like the color a lot. Well, I'm gonna give it an eight and a half. It kind of snatches you in. Broke it. The next thing I'm gonna try on is the Cozy Up Pants Set in Burgundy, and it's a large. Um, by the looks of it, this is seems really thick but it's called cozy up so it's almost off the shoulder but no it's not supposed to be like this it comes like that i really 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 like this because it's long it goes all the way down to my ankles all the way down it's very comfy when i first put it on i was like whoa i don't know if you would consider these leggings or not because they're more on the thicker side um it's tight at the waist but low to roll out so that's it's secure it's not falling down i don't even have rolls so it's making me look like i got a little bit of rolls they got pockets on the side i don't really like this that's not really cute to me but at least it's not like a camel toe or anything it's not this bright i'm gonna show you what it actually looks like yeah it's dark i feel like an instagram model oh these come on loose if you wanted to wear it like this but i would wear it all the way buttoned up what would you rate this i give it a nine because from what i can see the color isn't too far off from your hair and i like the buttons 
The buttons up here were put together. Yeah. On to the next. This jumpsuit is called Most Reliable Jumpsuit. And it fits really good, really snug. The material is like so soft. I don't even know what material this is, but it's real soft. And this smells weird. So did the first pair of jeans I put on. They smelled weird. But it smelled like it was like at the bottom on the floor at the factory or something. I'm gonna have to wash these before I wear them for real. For real, for real. I don't wanna smell like this. But it has a line right here that connects the top and the bottom. They go all the way down, which is something I really, really, really vouch for. It sucks in right here, so I'm glad it doesn't do that. They thought about that. I do think it's slimming. I feel like it hides my 10 pounds. Hello. Okay, so I'm real happy with this one. This one is called Amanda Feather Set in the color red, and it's a large. I thought it was gonna fit loose and stuff because this looks loose, and I thought it was gonna be all cheap and flimsy, but it's not. They come all the way down to my ankles which I did not expect. And it has like a slit right here. Yeah, this is this is very risk taking for me because I usually don't wear red. Cause I feel like my hair is red so that, like I don't know why. I just always thought since my hair was red, it would be really tacky for me to wear red. My favorite part about this is the feathers on the bottom and the top. Let me take my socks off so y'all can really see. It goes all the way down. I did not expect it to go all the way down. It's real cute and i feel like it's classy because of the feathers my friends my friend didn't really like the feathers but i like them i don't know if it's the feathers or the smell of that last outfit but something got to me i know what y'all thinking y'all like didn't you just have that on but red yes i got it in black too because as i said that red was like me taking a risk because i i always thought red was like a grown color so I went ahead and got it in black as well, just because I knew I would be safe with black. Um, I do like the red one better, so I didn't even have to get this, but this is still a cute outfit, nonetheless. The seams will rip easily, which I kind of ripped it right here a little bit, but <clears throat> hopefully that doesn't turn into a hole, because that would be really devastating, but you could sew that back together easily. Something worked up my sinuses because <clears throat> probably was these feathers, I don't know. I'm real sensitive to deaths, by the way. Real bougie, yes. That's the name. Most of these outfits that I got are really bougie. So this looks bougie. Duh, 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 duh. Yep. So that concludes my fashion overhaul. And yes, everything came up to $600. However, if you download the app called Honey, it automatically like searches the website for all these coupons and it will select the best one that saves you the most money. And yes, it did save me like a hundred or something dollars. So I ended up only paying $451. So I suggest y'all to get that Google Chrome extension because it's well worth it. Um, that's why I bought so many outfits because it took away so much money um because i didn't really want to spend over 500 but technically 600 dollar haul if you don't get honey don't forget to comment like share and most of all subscribe because that really helps me out and if you really like this video then i accomplished my goal <laughs> i hope if you're thinking about ordering clothes i suggest that you just go for it um make sure you measure yourself I got a tape measure, well not a tape measure, but a clothes measure and measure it myself before I bought these. So do that because I would have never ordered a large and everything if I wouldn't have sized myself. So do that so you can avoid having any disappointments or having to return anything. And that's basically all I got to say. I know that I'm about to be a baddie after quarantine, that's for sure. But um, yeah. So 